good morning student today we are going to start science and in science we are going to start first chapter and first chapter is the circulatory system in this chapter there are five main topics which are a circulatory system that means uh, meaning of this chapter and second is heart third blood and fourth blood vessels and the last topic which is in this chapter is process of circulation of blood so we will start one by one but in previous classes we have already learned about some uh, organ system just like uh, respiratory system uh, digestive system and excretory system so one thing uh, what is organ or organ system what is organ and organ system system now about this first of all we should know uh, about what is cell what is tissues what is tissue in early classes means uh, uh, class 4 uh, you already know about what is cell what is tissue but here in our body there are millions of uh, uh, tiny blocks these are basic building blocks so these tiny blocks are called cell in our body so cell is actually the basic part of our body and these cells these cells are combined together and form tissues so we can say that a group of cell a group of cells is called tissues a group of cells is called tissues and cell is the basic building block basic building blocks of our body is called cell now cell are combined together to form tissues and tissues combined together and form organ so definition of uh, tissues is a group of cell joined together to make a tissues definition of tissues is a group of cells joined together to make and to make 
like a tissue so and a group of tissues join together make an organ this is the definition this is the definition of tissues and this is the definition of organ now these organs work together and form an organ system so there are mainly four <clears throat> organ system in our body first is respiratory system which is already um, studied in your class 3 and in this respiratory in this respiratory system the parts of body are nose uh, windpipe lungs these body parts combine and make a organ system which is known as respiratory system and in digestive system the part of body belongs a mouth a food pipe a stomach a small intestine a small intestine large intestine and anus these body parts belong to digestive system and the last excretory system in this system the body parts which are belongs uh, they are kidney and ureters bladder and urethra now in a circulatory system in circulatory system the parts of our body which are belong are heart blood blood vessels so now the question is what is a circulatory system circulatory system is a system that transport that transport um, nutrients nutrients gases circulatory system transport nutrients gases and uh, any other substances so these substances are transported by um, a system which is circulatory system to different uh, parts of our body that means all living organism so many similarities in their life process all of them eat uh, digest their food and draw energy from that food and remove waste material so 
how do nutrients water and gases reach each and every part of our body first of all this circulatory system transfer these nutrients to all the parts of our body through blood and blood vessels during the process of blood circulation so mainly circular system uh, sorry circulatory system in humans the major and you can say that important uh, role of this circulatory system are to transport nutrients and gases mainly oxygen oxygen to all the part of the body all the part of the body and second second major task of the circulatory system is collect and remove carbon dioxide from the body collect and remove remove carbon dioxide from the body so circulatory system in human is composed of three main components mainly heart blood blood vessels now i repeat again what is cell cell is basic building blocks of our body and what is tissues a uh, tissues uh, tissues are a group of cells joined together and what is organ a group of tissues joined together make an organ and organ make a system so there are four system in our body respiratory system digestive system excretory system and then circulatory system now circulatory system is the system that transports nutrients gases and uh, some other substances to different part of our body so for today it is enough and uh, some homework for all of you and homework is three question first is name the body parts which belongs to respiratory system number two question name the body parts which belongs to digestive system and the last question is name the body parts which belongs to excretory system thank you